Hi everyone, John Wild here and welcome to another taste review and this one's kind of interesting as you can tell in the background got a lot of construction going on. We're getting ready to decorate for Christmas holiday season. Uh, everybody likes to call it the holiday seasons. I'm sorry I call it Christmas. So if it could be the holiday season, it could be Christmas, whatever floats your boat, that's what we're getting ready to do in the background. So just wait to see what it's going to look like. It's going to look fantastic. But today we're going to do something that's not really new, but something's been around for a while, but you always know when it's the Christmas season, when this thing appears in the store. And we're going to do a taste test on this, just in case you've lived under a rock and you never tried this before. Or we're tasting this together, so I really want your opinion on what you think. But we're bringing, we're bringing a, uh, uh, oh, what was that? That was a little preview just flashed by. Yes, it's that time of the season. Little Debbie Christmas tree treats. Yes, we know this. Uh-huh. Every year you know it's Christmas time when these things appear in the store, right? And there you go. So we're going to try one of these for the first time uh, on a John Wilde taste test review. What do you think about these things? What is your favorite, like, Little Debbie quick to buy in the store Christmas treat thing? There's lots of them, apparently, but this is the most popular one. This is the one that I have more familiarity with than anything else. So, uh, yeah, I can't really leave the product up like I'm supposed to because if I do this, you can't see me. Or <laughs> maybe that's a good thing. All right, so here we go. We take it out of the package, and it looks like this. Okay, so it's actually pretty close to what it looks like on the box, which is kind of shockingly, surprisingly that. Also, in the back, you get games, too. This is, you know, you got a match. That's a challenge that I will try later. Anyway, so they come in these little individual uh, wrapped Christmas trees. And, uh, of course here at the John Wilde compound we take these little wrappers we put them back in plastic bags and they go back to the store to be recycled yes actually you can do that so we're gonna open this up okay all right little little sticky little messy we got these little green things little green I don't know what's that little green sugary things they kind of fall everywhere so be careful you don't know that's gonna happen that's why we vacuum this place <coughs> daily uh, it's really pretty. I like it. Look, it's a good setup. It almost looks like a like a Christmas cookie, but look, it's thick. It's it's like a it's like a cupcake, I guess in a way. So uh, we're gonna give this a try. See what we think. Here we go. Ready? And I'm gonna bite the top here. Here we go. All right. Naturally, they're going to be a little stale because don't tell how long they've sat around waiting for you to come by it. I would say it might melt the frosting a little bit. It's got a little center too. It's got a little frosting center. But I would say in the microwave for maybe five seconds, seven seconds, might heat it, might make it, but then it's going to make it really gooey. So this is the kind of thing you want to drink with a little bit of milk. Oh, and by the way, if you want to send me a mug of yours your business your organization I'll talk about you uh, leave me a message and I'll tell you how to send me your mug and I'll talk about you and drink out of your mug on one of these challenges okay so keep that in mind anyway uh, oh, and I love Batman stuff obviously so but send me anything you want to any state country world business doesn't matter I love coffee mugs and we'll talk Anyway, so I, I like it, and I'm, I'm bringing in the holidays. Uh, we're going to do a scale thing on this. Why not? From a scale from one being one of the worst things I ever put in my mouth. Oh. All the way up to ten being the greatest thing I've ever eaten in my entire life. Oh. I'm going to give this, I mean, it's Christmas, right? Mm. There's a Christmas staple, a little on the stale side. A little on the over sugary tasting side, but
but because it is such a popular thing, I'm going to give this a seven. A seven. I'm going to give it a seven. We're going to go with seven. And um, I enjoy it. Thank you for enjoying this entry into the Christmas season with me. What do you think? Have you eaten it? Do you like it? Um, tell me your Christmas story where it surrounds Little Debbie's. I want to hear them. Comment, please. Anyway, John Wild, welcome to the holiday season. We're going to be doing a lot of taste test challenges throughout the holiday season on a lot of holiday stuff. If you have any suggestions, let me hear about it and let me know your experience with Little Debbie Christmas snacks and suggest other things for me to try it. I will do it. Okay, so we'll see you soon. Take care. Peace, love, strength as always. Bye. I'm going to eat the last of this.